All right, YouTube world. This is a video suggested by a friend of mine, and what you are looking at is what my buddy Joe in Southeast Georgia or Southwest Georgia, excuse me, calls a bug out bag room, and it is a very tiny closet <laughs> that I have uh, taken over, and uh, we have stuff stacked in here, and um, explain what I've done. Basically, like the clothing items here. I've got them separated into my girlfriend's. This is all her gear. Her camelback. Little pouch she's got. And the ammo belt separates it from my stuff, which is on this side. You saw my gear. And then on the left side of the wall, there's my Mossberg 590. This is my tactical vest. Below it is an ammo can. To the left's rifle. Down in the bottom here, way back in the back, is my backpack. And on down further is my boots, her boots. And on the right side is her backpack. Here, her poncho, her Alice Webb gear, M1 carbine, her hats and stuff. And on top we got our gun cleaning supplies, sight vice, laser uh, bore siding system, cleaning kits, and so forth. Not much to it. The first thing I did when I got in here is I cleaned out the space to see what I had to work with, which is not much. There's no way in hell to put a gun rack in here because none of my long guns would fit except the M1 carbine and it's just not enough to put a whole gun rack in here for one lousy gun. And then I attached anchor points and simple nails like that there, just to hold up light items. My hat, same thing up there. Now this closet did not have an electric electrical outlet. It did not have a light, so I went in and I ran a wire through the wall, put in an outlet, and hooked up a simple cheap light. I think we paid like seven, eight bucks for it, Wally World. On this side here, we've got nails up there for different items also another heavier hanger right here that's uh hooked into the uh stud behind the wall down below less used items and no storage containers 